Uh, the mobile marketing profession is really just starting to reach its maturity. Mobile phones have obviously been around for a while, but in terms of uh, being an effective tool for reaching consumers, uh, you know, we're obviously really just starting to reach a critical mass where it's become mainstream. Uh, that being the case, as we are in a transition period, there have been uh, a number of companies who have expressed difficulties in filling positions uh, in marketing manager roles uh, to kind of uh, to catapult brands into the mobile space effectively. Uh, there are a few problems. One of them is that a lot of the times uh, firms are just placing people who have experience online into mobile strategic roles and the issue is that mobile and online are not the same. Uh, there are key differences uh, one, for example, being that mobile is an opt-in paradigm, which makes it very different from online. Um, I think you'll see as more ad buy uh, is focused on mobile, as more people begin to uh, use mobile as a marketing medium, and as it becomes more, uh, more, uh, more similar to online in terms of uh, the amount of money put into it, I think you will see the experience gap filling out. And I think you will see more people with a more well-rounded base of knowledge about mobile marketing tactics and strategy. Uh, but for the time being, there's definitely a gap. And there uh, definitely, you know, there are not that many individuals with uh, consolidated bases of knowledge about all the different mobile tactics out there and all the different channels. And, you know, for now that's an issue. And it's something that, uh, I mean, companies are going to have to continue to address it and work to make sure that uh, they can orchestrate mobile campaigns with the efficacy that they need to be able to. So we'll see what happens.